Hey guys, this is just something. Hey guys, this is just something I wanted to show off that I entirely forgot about. I was supposed to do this a few episodes back. I believe episode 49. I was supposed to have done this. But, here in the captain's house, you'll see on the walls, there's his ship. There's an anchor, presumably from the ship. There's one of his crewmates loading barrels. There's their ship again. Over here, this is a Titanic reference, obviously, if you've watched Titanic ever. That's Skipper himself. And here he is with his whole crew on their pride and joy. And then over here, there's a note. Dear Captain, thanks for everything, Zert. Here's the crew. Now, it may be a little depressing to think of it in this way, but I think that is in fact these guys sitting around here that wrote that letter. Uh, okay, there's less than I thought, but these two guys, I think that they wrote that letter to their captain when they thought they'd never see him again. They waited up in his house hoping maybe he'd return. But, as we know, he never did, and he never can. So now with that, back on to the show. Thank you for getting my ship back, Vern. It may have been half rent, but my crew and I got shaped up to almost proper working order in no time, Vern. I wish you good luck in finding whomever it is you're looking for, for weep. Come visit again. You're welcome anytime. Weep. What's up, guys? Welcome to your daily dose, Joseph. I'm your host, Joseph Jason Manton. In the last episode, we took on Tentalus. And as well, in the last episode, our batteries were dying. They have been for a while now. Uh, first things first, let's talk to Skipper. Let's get going quick. Don't you need to find that person you're looking for? Or do you need me to take the boat somewhere else and see? Take me to the sea! Alright, let's go! Now you may be asking yourself, Well, what's out here in the Great Blue Sea? Well, one, there's the ship in case you miss getting that piece of heart. You can go back and get it now. Uh, over there, you can see the... Ugh, what is that thing? I, don't even... I want to say that's the stronghold, but it's kind of like got a very much more prominent pointed tip. Oh my god! Alright, screw that. But neither of those are what we want. Oh my god, rocks everywhere. We want to head back to the shipyard. You remember where Skipper screwed us by taking us there and there was nothing there? Well, he didn't really screw us because he introduced us to one of the most important places in the game. What? Okay, well, maybe not one of the most important. In fact, you don't even need to go back there to beat it. But, I like to. Over there is Skipper's Retreat. Again, if you want to go there and feel... Oh, no, this is the place we want to be. My bad. Hey! Alright, where's my dot? There's my back. There it is. I see it. Hello. No. There we go. Welcome back to the shipyard. For the second time now. Well, not welcome back for the second time, but welcome on your second journey to the shipyard. Oh, Joseph, whatever could we be doing here? Oh, don't worry about that. Not nothing to do with these guys. We're just gonna let them flail around aimlessly. Why are they just sitting there? Like, what's their job? Who put them there? To the ship center. Let's go to the ship center. Hello. Hey, you. What are you doing? Well, you're here now. So how about a little fun? <laughs> fun? Got your attention, eh? <laughs> let me explain. Oh man, last time I had fun with a guy. This is a race against time. Scream across the finish line as fast as you can. 
That's just what he said to me last time, too. Tilt the Wii Remote to lean your cart. If you lean at just the right angle on the corner, you'll get a nice speed boost. Lose your co concentration when you're cruising around in a bend, though, and you'll run right off the rails. If that happens, you lose the race. Okay, he's not like the last guy that won fun with me. What do you say? Have you got the guts to ride the rickety coaster? Just 20 rupees a ride. All right, I'll do it, mainly because I'm scared of you. Let's go for the heart-stopping course. If you want the heart-stopping track, eh? You got it. Bye, I hope you're ready. Oh, my body is ready. It's all right, let's get going. All right, so, just as before, hold your Wii Remote with both hands for this, and I'm probably going to fail this first time, or maybe not. Point is, uh, just like before, when there's a turn, you lean into the turn, you get a speed boost, you tilt your car to get a, uh, when there's a split in the tracks to get, to go in that direction. And if you turn on straight away, it actually is the worst thing you can do. It slows you down, like I just did there. Dang it. Oh, man. Okay, yes, we're at the left. Now, hold right. Hold right some more. And hold right. And then left. And then right. Yeah, left. Right. Oh, my God. Oh, there's no way we... Uh, yeah, I, I didn't expect to win this. This is my first time today. Last time I did this, which was yesterday, it took me a half hour of rage, literally. There may be hope for us yet, okay? There's no way. No, okay. Yeah, there's no way I got this. Oh man. I got some good time though for a first run. Oh man. Would have been beautiful if I got on my first track. You finished! Not a bad time. Nope, none at all. Here's your prize. You got a monster horn! Thank you for that, sir. Hope you come by here again soon. Yeah, I'm back, man. Let's go. The heart's... No, I'm stupid. I got it. No, I did it. I win. Oh man, that was so much better than yesterday. Yesterday it took me like 32 minutes. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That was unbelievable. Even I cannot go that fast. Here you go! I found this treasure right here on this very island! You got a piece of heart! Where was this on our first trip? Where did you find it? I'm so mad. Hope you come by again soon! That was the wrong voice. Basically, if you want to, you can come back by here again anytime. And it's basically the same as playing the uh, bamboo game. You get random collectibles and stuff. So, not all that bad. Anyways, next! Hello, Skipper! I remember when my ship was finished with really being built here. I was so happy. Ah, the good old days. Louise. He's so sad. Shall we set sail? Yes. But now, I will see you guys back home. Or, well, not back home, back on land. Scoop. Now this is just something here real quick. This is pretty sad. If you come to Skipper's Retreat and you talk to him, my house holds many dear memories of my family. I wonder when I'll be able to go back home. I really want to see my family again. I feel so bad. I just want to get him a freaking a time shift crystal and put it on a necklace or something or just stick it under his hat make make a pin out of it pin it to his hat I feel so bad for him 
Poor guy. Anyways, I'll see you guys back at shore. Alright guys, I know this is a little weird to be back here. Yes, that's the temple. Yes, that's where the Goron guy is. I'm gonna switch to my bug net real quick. I'm gonna put it away. This is something I found. Is uh, in this area, if you go first person and exit first person at the right area, I'm not sure where, you can spawn a tumbleweed. And I am in desperate need of those. There's one. You got a tumbleweed! So I just wanted to show that off. If you're low on tumbleweeds, you can come here and get them like that. It's pretty good. Alright, now we're back to the sky. It's been a long time since we've been here. <clears throat> I'm sorry for all the awkward backtracking that we were just doing, but it's all good, don't worry. Everything's about to pick right on up. No more jokes. Yeah! Now here we are, back in Skyloft. Oh, sweet, sweet Skyloft. I thought I'd never see you again. I miss you. Hey, Fledge, my boy! How's that workout coming? Hey there, Joseph. I've been training hard at night since you gave me that stamina potion. But, I don't know. It started feeling like maybe I've reached my peak. Like maybe I'm just wasting my time. I don't know if I'll ever be as strong as you, Joseph. Still, there's nothing to be gained from feeling sorry for myself. So I'll keep working out every night. Come by any, any time in to give me pointers. Alright, I'll give you a pointer, alright. So, what I want to do here, before anything else, is we are going to go to the scrap shop. Talk to my boy, I believe his name was Gondo. Gondo! I want to see what I can upgrade, man. Let's see what's going on here. Sweet! Upgrade to the Iron Bow! Go for it, man. Okay. I see, this is something... I'm not sure if I actually mentioned this. Earlier when I said that you might find yourself short on money if you play like my friend Jared did, he got every upgrade. I never mess with the upgrades at all. This is my first time messing with the upgrades. You got the Iron Bow! Okay. If you got anything else you want to upgrade, just let me know, alright? And we can upgrade our Iron Bow to... A Sacred Bow! But yes, if you do this enough, you'll probably find yourself... Uh, a little short on money. But... <clears throat> no worries. It's still... Awesome. This is totally worth it. After upgrading some of my items, I realized what a waste it was to never upgrade. You have upgraded to the Sacred Bow! It uses a sacred power of the goddess to retain, rain, a terrible force upon your enemies. If you got anything else you want me to tinker around with, you just let me know. And, oh, well, you know, wait, 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 I want to see if I can upgrade my bug net. Oh my! A report master. Because of the improvement to your sword, you can now use your dowsing ability to locate treasure. Please, use the additional entries in your dowsing target listed at your leisure and convenience. Real quick, Gondo, my boy. You're not gonna waste my time, are you? Ain't got no time for this if you're gonna waste it. Alright. Dang it! Alright, whatever. Alright guys, I think that was enough for today. I know it wasn't much, I got a piece of heart and I got some upgrades, but honestly I love the upgrades. But, I promise you that tomorrow will be a much better day. Okay? Just promise me you'll be back and I can promise you- oh wait. Welcome! Uh, Sorry, I shouldn't be signing in front of a customer. You see, recently I've been a, uh, uh, I haven't been able to sleep at night. 
Ah, uh, sorry, I also shouldn't be complaining in front of a customer. Again. Ah, uh, welcome to my humble little side business over here. He's gonna tell us that whole thing again. But we ain't doing that. Back out. Yabba back out. Alright, so he can't sleep at night. I think we can probably do something about that. Help the poor old guy out. He's doing his best to provide for his family, so I think he deserves it. What do you say? So, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed. I hope to see you back tomorrow when we take on whatever I decide to do next. <laughs> That's right. It's a mystery. It's a secret to everybody. Thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time.